Hey guys, how are you going? So far we have covered how to find the median and the mean and we're gonna move on to finding the mode which is actually the easiest uh, thing to find. So you'll probably find that this video is the easiest video that we have done so far. Okay, so the first thing we need is a group of data so I'm just going to uh, make up some numbers So here are my numbers that make up my data. So uh, what we notice is that the number 4 has occurred three times. So mode is actually the most frequent number. So in this case, it's 4. Now you can also have two modes. So in this case, uh, in another case, let's say we have three, 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 four, 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 five, six. So the mode can be three and four. They're both modes. Uh, you could also have no mode. So for example, three, four, five, six. In this set of data, uh, there is no mode. Okay, thanks for watching the tutorial on finding the mode. I'll see you next time.